Um, I'm called by the name uh, Sir Richard Enyaku. I'm the chairperson LOC2 of Amor Ward here in the Sorote City West. So what is this you're having today? Today we are having a baraza mm. with the community including some few leaders from the city. Mm. We intend to come up with a petition on the issue of the sub-county land mm. which the government has done good to bring for us a blood bank and a referral hospital is coming here. Now we have fear. We have fear towards this project because of the land in encroachers. We have people who have owned here land in whichever way we don't understand. Why do I say so? Even those who, who say they got it genuinely from the former council are not coming into the open for us to know them. Now, there is a lot of gambling with land here. There is nobody who has ever shown us the true land title of this place. And yet we are seeing good projects coming. We do not want these projects to go away from here because they are for our benefit. Mm. So, so, so what are you after? Now, when we come up with this petition, we want the commissioner together with the minister of local government and our leaders to come in, get intervened into this issue, for, and that is the solution we think that can help us. Uh, give us the amount of land in total. The land in question is of what quantity? And how much quantity has been encroached or grabbed away by the so-called encroachers, allegedly by you? Uh, NBS, I cannot tell you the quantity of this land. The reason being, uh, I'm not well acquainted with that reading. of. Hmm? Okay. So for that, therefore, it is not until that time comes when the real land surveyor comes and tells us the quantity of the land. Uh, I am William Opeche Echuru. Uh, I work in Soroti City Western Division as a chairperson of the Area Land Committee for West Division. Uh, West Division comprises a number of wards, of which one, this one is Amoru Ward, which is one of them where this land issue is. I also happen to be a stakeholder in this world. This is where I come from. Uh, some time back, some few years, that issue of uh, proposal, a proposal came to get land for establishing a blood, uh, that blood unit and uh, also the referral hospital for Soroti. And uh, this place was selected. If you go to the other end, you'll see there's construction work going on, the blood bank. The construction work is going on. Where we are currently here is the place which is earmarked for the construction of the referral hospital because it's supposed to be moved away from the present place where it is in town and the other one remains a city hospital. But uh, the community here is disturbed because the, uh, the amount of land that is said to be uh, to have been given now to the, for the construction of the regional hospital is not commensurate with what the people here know. We have also learned that towards the establishment of the, the coming in place of the city council, the leadership of this area, political and technical, are said to have embarked on leasing out and selling plots. They plotted much of this, especially the other side, and also this side. That is why you have seen the community moving around and showing people where the boundaries, the original boundaries of the sub-county land is. Here you have been able to see members who served in the area land committee for Arapai sub-county, the people who served as technical staff and councillors have moved around and shown people. But if you see the area now here, it is not really, it doesn't make 19 acres, it doesn't make 19 acres at all. What we see here is just a few acres. But uh, I'm, I'm optimistic that uh, the community will be able to recover that land. Because they know the boundaries. You have seen what is disturbing mostly is this. When you look at houses like this, 
including the other building of the sub county chief that residence there is said to have been marketed out and this is a government this and these are institutional houses so we are wondering what happened did the procurement and disposal act procedure was it followed or not unfortunately where the land title for this place lies is not in the hands of the city council so we as the area land committee we have not yet been mandated even to move around here but uh, maybe the, when time comes and the boundaries are open, we shall be able to establish. We are also moving with the community now to see what is happening. But you can see the anger from the community. They are not happy. And the people whom we had expected to be here, none of them is here. They are, I mean the technical staff and the political leadership including those ones at the district. None of them is here. It is also very unfortunate that uh, some people from the, some officials from the city council have not come. But what the community here wants to know is who was given land? That is the question they are giving the people. And there are people whom you saw who put up their hands as being the people who were, who were leased some of this land. But some of them, I think it was just sold to them. Okay. I, I think that's what I think. I am called Chen Joseph. I am the Deputy Mayor West Division. Uh, as per today, I represent the Mayor. It is true, the community of Arapai uh, Parish, I mean Arapai Ward, have petitioned the Land Commission on the issues of land. Uh, you find that the land we have land here in Arapai, Arapai Ward. Some of the, the part of the land has been given to the, 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 the blood bank. And the part of it, uh, it has been given to the referral hospital, regional referral hospital. So therefore, the land which has been given to the hospital generally, it is 19.9 acres. Uh, that is the land with the the, 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 the the Ministry of Health has given to the hospital. And the, generally today, when we moved around, we, we moved around, the locals who are the indigenous and the people who have stayed there for a long period of time, they actually took us through the whole land of uh, Arapai by then to the sub-county, took us all the government land. We moved around all, whereby they showed us where the mark stones were. We saw some of the mark, you know, mark stones. And the challenge is, uh, we do not have the land title with us as a division or as a city. Reason being, we have tried our level of best to see that uh, we get all these titled land pieces to the division or to the city and it is so happened that like somehow somewhere we have a problem with our sister the district they have not disclosed they have not given us the land titles of all those pieces of land that they had before